Hey, what's up? I'm Daniel from thedaysiphone.com, and you are in for a treat today, parents. I'm going to show you how to enable restrictions for your children's iPhone or iPod Touch. Here you go. Now that I'm 18, I can teach you this kind of stuff because I'm responsible. Yes. So you're going to go to settings. You're going to go to general. General. And then you're going to go to restrictions. And you're going to hit enable restrictions and you're going to have to enter a passcode 1234. 1234. I wouldn't suggest using 1234, it's really quite easy. Um, and you get all these options Safari, YouTube, iTunes, uh, installing apps, camera, FaceTime, location, in app purchases. Um, you, well, this isn't really a choice, this is what, <laughs> what ratings you want in the United States if you live in the United States. Um, explicit for music and podcasts. I'm going to switch that off, actually, because I don't need to see anything that's not clean. Um, movies, all, TV shows, all, apps, all. I don't really download any movies or TV shows. Um, but, so you get all these options, so if you want to put FaceTime off, Safari off, YouTube off, iTunes off, installing apps off, and pretty much you just gave your kid a camera, but, um, and I guess, you know, I don't know what else it would be good for but you could you know choose obviously like let's say you only wanted them to do these things like, you don't want them to do facetime or installing apps i don't know why you get an iphone 4 if you don't want them to use facetime but you know who knows so you could you know turn off and on whatever you deem necessary because you are the parent and then for um content you get to choose obviously all over again you know per in-app purchases yes or no all this kind of stuff and once you're done, you just leave it, and then when you go back, it's going to, and you hit um, uh, restrictions, it'll ask you to put the password in so your kid can't change it. So I'm Daniel from thedaysiphone.com. I hope this was helpful. Um, I hope your kid isn't going to be too mad at me, um, and I hope you guys have a great day convincing your kid why his phone can't go on iTunes anymore. See you guys. Come to thedaysiphone.com for much more.